Behold, I'm the conqueror of hell. Wielder of yo-yos and bees. Collector of voodoo dolls. Ow! Oh no, I'm dying. Help. The point is I bought some like vanity horns from a secret trader and now I look like the devil. Look at that. Look at that. I look badass. The cloak's also now working too. Looking pretty thick, but honestly, that's a good look for me. Now I want to explore hell in more depth. You see this chest right here? They open with a shadow key that I was able to obtain from Skeletor's dungeon. Open up this bad boy. Look at that. I now have an agile flower of fire. You jealous? You should be. I can now literally and metaphorically spit fire. I also found this book by killing demons. I can now do this too, which is pretty- Ah, oh, lava! It's like a slightly bad version of this healing potion. Reduce potion cooldown. Ew, that's pretty dope. That's real. Ah! I'm gonna open up chat. Yo, have you seen this butterfly though? Come here. No, I murdered it! There's two things I want to do in this episode, okay? I want to go to every single chest and reap the rewards that I deserve. And I want to kill a boss. I'm ready. I want to kill a boss. I'm sick of not killing a boss. It's been one whole video that killed a boss. Unacceptable. What is this? A guarding treasure magnet. Can be worn in vanity slots. Increase pickup range for items. Kind of, but I'm pretty sure we can combine it with something really awesome and cool. Um, could you please? I'm gonna die here. This is my tomb. Ah, it's a room full of lava! It's another treasure magnet. That's fine, I guess. Not really. So yeah, I want to go like in a big old looting spree, which is so fun for me personally. And then I want to do the boss down here, which will hopefully unlock uh, hard mode. How do we kill the final boss? Well, it's very simple. You know, if you were smart anyway. Yo, look at this lance, dude. It's huge. Look at this huge ass lance. Sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna build a giant like track all the way to the right hand side. So far we've done like, what, a quarter of the map? I want to do at least half the map before I do the boss, preferably. Now you would have thought like making a huge runway um, in the entirety of hell would be pretty easy, right? It's not. It's difficult. Uh, it's full of like hell bats, demon spawn, and fire. Lots of lava toots. Lots of lava. Ooh, a ruthless sun fury. I'm not gonna use it, but like, I, I could if I wanted to. But no, making this runway, I've died many times. Multiple times here. It's difficult. It's hard. I'm having a hard time here. It's a struggle. Once I'm satisfied by the amount of loot we've gotten, uh, I will then like move on to the boss, and hopefully the boss will be a one-time deal. I'll be using my B arrow thing. The B arrows are so great, honestly, in every single way. Why am I not using, you know, the yo-yos? I love yo-yos. Uh, yo-yo suck right now, man. I'm not gonna lie. I remember them being much better. They seemingly suck ass right now. I'm not about that lifestyle. Please leave me alone! Oh, they are relentless. They are absolutely relentless. Just leave me alone. Go. Shoo. You know what? I'm gonna lock you in there. There you go. Enjoy quarantining. You know what? Let me in here. I'm sick of <laughs> doing this the bitch way. I'm impervious to lava right now. I might as well just go through it. Yep, let all the lava in here. I ain't coming back here, I don't care. But here I am, just like going through the place, like, you know, using the doors and hallways like an idiot. We have the ability to destroy everything. We can destroy everything. We are the destroyer of hell. <gasps> Excuse me? The Cascade. Oh. Yo. Yo. All right, maybe we should use a yo-yo build. What's in here? Hellwing, mm, little mighty bow. Wouldn't arrows turn into flaming bats? It's kind of cool. The most fun part of this game is honestly the loot. I love loot. I freaking love this loot right now. Oh, an ornate shadow key. Summons a pet. Oh, what? It's, it's, I'm having way too much fun here. All right, get rid of this. Pick up this. Sure, make me invisible. There you go. Now you see me, now you don't. What is this? Summons a shadow pet. Oh, there he is. I legit couldn't see him. All right. I mean, what's my shark's name? Christopher. Don't really want to get rid of Christopher here. But yo, that's awesome. All right. This is where, this is as far as I got so far. So, very simple. Oh my goodness. There we go. <laughs> very simple. We make a, a flat stone pathway 
It's the end of hell. Oh my, I keep doing this. I feel like there's a better way of doing this. This is a very slow way of doing it, isn't it? So I spent hours trying to make this path earlier. Uh, I kept dying over and over and over again. To the point where I was like, you know what? It's all right. This is as far as I go. We'll do the rest in the video uh, where people can see me die and shout and swear. I think people might enjoy that. We should probably like not go down here. Oh, well, that guy's looking for us. Honestly. Have you found us yet? Are you honest about us? Oh my god, these bats. These bats are the bane of my life. No! You know what? Take that. Take a little shield bash there. Oh my god, it's never ending. It's just nothing never ending. Just more demons or some kind of like asshole just there just to ruin your day. Non-stop. You're trying to build like a giant path so you can kill that overlord master and they won't let you. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Oh no. Oh my goodness. Please. Just follow the, yeah, follow the cliff. Leave me alone. No. Oh my god. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Oh my god. Leave me alone. There must be a way to load a spawn right in hell. Alright, I'm about to give up here and be like, hey, surely this is enough. Don't tell me this isn't enough. These guys are the worst. Now I have to wait for the lava to run off your bridge, just wasting your time. And then some hellbats will come along and try and murder you while you're stationary, waiting for the lava to drain. And then some more lava bats will come, so you have to stop what you're doing, kill them, move to your block icon, stop building. But no, don't worry, because soon... Another hellbat or imp or demon or slime will come along to stop you from making progress in the game. Thus is the circle of life and hell. What an appropriately named shitty place to be in. Enough. Oh, okay. Also, everyone go up. Wait for the lava to drain. Gameplay, everyone. Such wonderful gameplay. We're probably almost done. And if we're not, then I'll just, I'll look. I wanted to do something else just to make sure this boss is killed because this is torture in its own right. You know what? You have to watch me suffer. I was going to do this entire bit off screen where I make the, the giant walkway and you guys don't have to watch me suffer and complain. But you know what? If I'm going to endure this hell, so do you. Well, actually, uh, Chosie, I really enjoy it when you're mad and upset. There's like an item you can buy from the builder that can make this actually much easier. You just go up here, wait for a while. Oh, another slime. I guess we'll just stay here forever. Maybe some of you guys are saying, hey, you should have made the- Oh my goodness, let me speak. You should have made the walkway out of, like, platforms instead. That way the lava will drain through it. Yes, I do realize that now. Now that I'm saying it out loud, I realize, oh my goodness. Quickly, make a uh, tunnel. There you go. Go down there, lava. All right, map. Where are we? You know what? Look at that. That is ah. That's that's plenty. We're no. We're we're ready. We're ready for this. Let's go. I don't care. This could be like a ten-minute video. I just don't. I don't care. Any no. Just no more. Just no more of that, please. Just no more, please. <laughs> just in terms of weapons, I don't really want to sell anything. People are saying to make this big giant sword in it. It requires you to have all these other swords to combine to make the almighty sword. And although that seems really cool, it's also a lot of work. So for now, I guess, I will just keep all the swords I find until I find a way or time to craft the almighty sword. So honestly, things we need is obsidian skin potion in case a slime is on the walkway. We don't burn to death there. Or in case I mean, how do you even get my house, man? How do you get inside my house, Riley? Uh, what else do we want? Uh... Looking at all this, invisibility, I guess, maybe? 20% <laughs> arrow speed and damage seems really important for us because we are going to be using our bee, uh, bee's knees. Yep, demonic bee's knees. I think that's all we need. And I think this is going to be extremely easy. Finally, after 40 minutes of complaining and whinging and moaning and making the walkway, we have finally approached the point where we can finally do the final boss. Finally. The way we spawn him, very simple. I remember this bit because of how f***ed up it was. Please don't kill me. Oh my god, you're gonna... Oh, I've just got in here. I just got to hell. I've Im literally immediately upon entry of hell. It is hell. Go, go away. Shoo, shoo. I'm gonna like chuck this boy up out here. There you go. Into the lava, you go. Right. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, 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 okay. Is 
he still going? Or... Yeah, he's still going. Wall of Flash, he's gonna make his way across the other side here. Okay, so... Oops. I thought he would go from left to right. I remember him going left to right. I remember that very clearly. Why is he going left? Why did he immediately start le Why is this- Why? Oh, increase max number of minions. One, two, three, four, five. <gasps> Wait, it's probably four. No, it's just four. Still, I'll take that. Now that we failed in that, we can't- We can't do it again straight away. So, in the meantime, we might as well make another walkway or like a longer walkway. I hate being so sh- <laughs> just... You know, you spend- a good amount of hours preparing for a boss and then immediately dying to it. Immediately. It wasn't like, oh, uh, you struggled a bit and you finally survived there. No, immediate death. All right, well, I'm not gonna catch up to it and kill it. But yo, you see, look, look how much damage we did though. In that small amount of time where we were struggling to like get past it. I was trying to like, get behind it, by the way. We actually like did quite a lot of damage in, it's, in such a short period of time. So honestly, I'm actually kind of like, yo, this is gonna be so easy. We just need to like make sure to oh! spawn in the right place. Oh, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Go back home, just go back home, okay? Just, <laughs> it's, I just, just go back home. So what is this then? On fire, yeah, I know that. So I think um, because we killed the guide, Cyril's now here, right? Life's like a box of clothes. You never know what you're gonna wear. Such a wise man, a familiar wig. Yo, you can cosplay as the guide, right? So the creepy old man's now here to stay. I guess we need some more houses in the Mud Motel. Yeah, we're kind of like, we're severely lacking. Okay, I got it. Oh my God. <laughs> Alright, so from now on, I'm gonna just use a rope. It's what it's there for. Just in case we fall to our death, you know? Where were we? Oh, yeah. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, my lord. Oh, my sweet baby lord. Jesus Christ almighty. <laughs> I'm not even religious. I'm just really fed up with this. It does seem like we're in lava, but I'm pretty sure we're okay. Honestly, just use this obsidian skin potion. We have so many of them. I made so many for a reason. Please, just leave me alone. Oh, it's a slime. Well, you know what? I used an obsidian skin potion, you bitch! I'm impervious to your slime residue. Lord of Cheese was torn in half by Hellbat. Yep, seems about right. Could you go away, Hellbat? Finally, some more treasure. Love it. Um... No. Why can't I open- Where's my key gone? Alright, I guess we won't be opening this today. For some reason, my keys. You know what? I'll go back home. I'll go back home. No, I'll do. It. I'll do. It. Why? Why is the key gone? So, okay. You know what? Delete this or sell it. Even can we sell this key? I have realized a really annoying thing in Terraria is if you have more than one item and you put it in side. Delete that. If you put it inside a chest, it will auto stack on that. So a shadow key. If you got like one too many, which I did, it means if you do like the quick stack here for nearby chests, it will, you know, take away your key. There's a way you can like lock stuff in the hot bar up here. There's also a way you can lock stuff, lock stuff in your inventory as well, actually. Um, I remember someone saying how to do that. I, I have no idea how, I forgot everything. I'm sorry, man. Oh my fucking piece of shit. Accidentally using the magic mirror is the bane of my existence. I, you have no idea how many times I did that by accident. Off screen. Yeah, I didn't mean to use a magic mirror there. Yeah, that was a mistake. That was a huge mistake. That was a big mistake. That was a huge. Okay, I'm ready for the boss. Wall of flesh is awakened by throwing the guide food doll into the pool of lava while the guide is alive. So the, the guide. Isn't alive, I'm guessing. Oh, we have to make a new house. We have to make a new room before we can do it again. Okay. Um, it is known by players as the most difficult pre-hard mode boss. <laughs> Bitch, please. It's also considered the final boss of pre-hard mode because by defeating the wall of flesh, it will irreversibly enable hard mode in that given world. Its defeat will also uh, allow the creation of summoning items for various hard mode bosses. It can also drop several powerful items. 
call, like the Pawn Hammer, which can be used to break demon altars. The wall flesh will then sweep across the map, moving faster as the HP gets lower. Oh, okay, that's kind of scary. Alright, I want to quickly make a small little house for our stupid ass guide. Make sure he's surrounded by demon blocks, just to make sure he knows how cursed he is. There you go. There's your room, guides. Watch out for lava. I guess now we just wait for him to move in. Is that right? Steve the guide has arrived. Beautiful. Okay, I hope you like your, your new room, Steve. Uh, you won't be staying with us very long, though, I'm afraid. So the wall of flesh will go from one side to another depending on where you drop the voodoo doll. I dropped it slightly to the left hand side and therefore it decided to go from right to left. Um, that was a bad mistake. Alright, this is probably a good place to start it, right? I'm ready. Could you please stop spawning more enemies? Just stop! Just stop that! Oh my god, they won't stop. They never stop. They never stop coming. I, I can't do anything. They never stop coming. Oh my god. I, I literally want to spawn the boss right now. And I can't. Because they don't stop spawning. They never stop. They just never- they never- they keep on coming. I'm going insane here. So press B to do- Oh. Oh, stop coming! Uh, go. He didn't make it, did he? Oh my. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Okay, run. Okay, B, buff, go, I'm ready. Okay, this is where we, uh, oh my god, he has lasers. I can't even see it right now. Oh, there he is. Oh, oh! Okay, I'm actually terrified here. Could you, I'm gonna die here, I'm gonna die here. I am spamming the haste button in the hopes of gonna heal very soon though. Ew, ew, okay. Oh, he's, he's, he's firing lasers at me. Please, let me, let me heal. Ah, oh! ah, ah, heal! Heal! Oh, thank God. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is just the worst day I've ever had in my life. I'm absolutely spamming the button here, man. I'm clicking furiously. Please stop. Okay, five seconds and I can, like, oh. Ah. Uh, so five seconds and I can do the potion. I help. Am I even recording anymore? I think I pressed stop recording. This is a disaster. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Just, just face it. This is a wipe. It's okay. It's okay. It's a wipe. It's a wipe. You can have wipes. Uh, one more hit and I'm dead. No! Well, we got kind of close there, honestly. Man, they are going at me there. Yep, there you go. Okay. That was probably like a complete disaster there. Um, everything that could have happened that was bad did happen. We uh, alt-tabbed at some point. We literally just took so much damage there. Um... It could have gone better. It could have gone so much better. I don't want to give up here. I'm going to try again. But first, I want to see what kind of potions we can make. Reduces damage taken by 10% requires a fish. So we can't do that. A lot of these potions actually require fish. Um, I haven't really fished at all in the game. And thus, we probably can't do a lot of these, which is just fantastic. What we can do, though, is an iron skin potion to increase our defense by eight. That seems pretty good, though. Regeneration potion is also a really good one to have. Should make more of those. And more movement speed would also help out. Blink root is apparently a very good material to farm. It's used in a lot of potions. A lot of basic potions are pretty useful. Mushrooms and day bloom also great to have. Ah, crap. We need more, like, iron ore. And I used it all to make iron bars. Can we not transfer the iron bars back into ore? That doesn't seem like a thing we should be able to do, but I'm hoping we can. No, we definitely cannot do this. God, why are you so stupid? All right, we'll take the iron ore then at least. So regeneration potion. Yes, make like three of these for now. Okay, swiftest potion, pretty important here. Make three of these two, that way we get like a lot faster. That way when it does kind of like heat up, we can like outspeed the giant wall of flesh. Iron skin potion, extremely needed. Unfortunately, only have one. We need some more iron ore for that one. Maybe some iron ore just around here, you know. Some iron ore about here, please. I could see some, some ore right here, hold on. It's copper ore. I think copper ore works, right? It absolutely does not work. You want lead or iron. I think I'm ready now, but we do need to wait for the second sacrifice to appear. What new strats do I have for the wall of flesh? I don't know, man. Um, be less Don't alt tab by accident. You know, stuff like that. Do that. Kevin the guide. Congrats, Kevin. 
Congrats on being on next sacrificial porn. But we must feed the wall of flesh. Something like that. I don't know the lore behind the wall of flesh. But apparently, killing the guide will summon the wall of flesh. The wall of flesh has a soft spot for the guide. Woo! Get a room wall of flesh and guide. Oh, look, it's where I died last time. Ah! Oh my lord. Um, the cursor I'm gonna change to like a bright green. That way I get to see it. Because last time I couldn't even see my cursor. See, now I can clearly see the mouse here. Okay. That's fantastic. Beforehand, I was extremely struggling there. Okay, and we reached the end here. And I'm hoping this big fart over here will just die already. So we're a bit zoomed out here. Hopefully you guys don't mind. I know you guys kind of like want to see what's going on. If it's like too zoomed out, it's really hard to see what's going on. But for this boss, I need to make some space between me and him. And if I do that, I can't see what's going on. Goodbye. There we go. Slowly does it. There's a hell bat behind me. Of course there is. If you hear the laser sound, just jump around like that. There you go. Don't get too close to him, though. And we do kill, like, one of the weird, like, tentacle monsters. Oh my god, there's so many of them. When we do kill one of those, they will, like, fly off and try to attack us. But if we kill them, they might drop some hearts. So, there's always a big bonus there. The leeches have spawned now. Okay, there we go. Alright, cool. You're doing great. Keep it up. I'm proud of you. Just absolutely spam the living crap out of all your arrows there. Ah. Uh, okay, we are almost at the halfway mark in terms of, like, damage. That's great news. Kind of like a narrow place here. Maybe should have built a bit further downwards or upwards. Okay. Oh, this is, this is bad. This is, ah, he's catching up to me. This is where we died last time. We've already made progress here. Well done to me. Yeah, I should really, like, build some more room here. It's really hard to... Stop lasering me. He's almost dead. He's almost dead. We got this. He's almost dead. He's almost dead. We've got this. So easy. We've done it. Please. He's getting faster. Run. Run like crazy. Come on, don't run. Oh, he's, he's very fast. He's very fast indeed. Oh, we've done it. Oh, ho, ho, ho. the ancient spirits of light and dark have been released. Cool. Fan that's that's cool. That's fantastic. Could you f off? I've done it. I'm victorious. Corrupt slime. Oh, that doesn't seem good. What is this? What the hell are you doing here? What the hell? Ah! What the hell? Corruption? Dude, I just want to get... Oh, hell. Hell, just grab this and get out. Grab this and get out. Everything has changed now. Yo, okay. So, like, this is where we picked up. This is where we killed the wall of flesh. We had kind of, like, you know, some, some wiggle room there. It's okay. But we finally did it. We unlocked hard mode. We unlocked the spirits. Soul of night. And we have a treasure bag here. Let's see what we get. Hmm. <gasps> the breaker blade. It looks amazing. It makes me want to do like a sword build, honestly. I'm not gonna lie. Maybe I should do a sword build. What is this? Oh, the demon heart. Permanently increases the number of accessory slots. Um. There you go. Yo, that's that's dope. That's really dope. What is this? Increases the range damage. That's so good if we were to go down the route of the, the, the bowman. I don't think I'm going to though. I wonder if we can still get the other emblems because these emblems seem crazy good. <gasps> we got the porn hammer! Strong enough to destroy demon altars. Right. Oh shit, what did I just do there? Okay, no, replace the dirt please. Put the dirt back, sir. That was awesome. That's sweet. The game has now changed though. The game has now completely opened up and changed. It's gonna be, it's a whole new world, man. It's gonna be a whole new world. A very scary world though. I'm looking forward to it. That's been Terraria guys. Thank you so much for watching the series and giving it a chance and supporting it as well. Uh, I really do appreciate you guys supporting something that's not Battle Cats. Uh, right now, recently, I've kind of like begged people in Battle Cats to branch out and watch my other series because uh, I am at a point where I am unemployed. I am solely relying on YouTube for financial support. And right now, I'm working uh, probably the double the hours of a cleaner, yet I get paid half as much. That's where I'm at right now. Luckily, I absolutely adore what I do. So there's that side to it, which is cool. And to those who say, hey, just get a job, are you kidding me? Unemployment rate is the highest it's ever been, ever. Uh, I, <laughs> like, off, pretty much.
But yeah, thank you so much for supporting the series. You know, my channel won't ever be able to make enough money for a minimum wage job without having without having multiple series that are supported. You know, I can't survive just on Battle Cats. It won't be enough. It will never sustain itself permanently. So having different series that are also kind of popular is really good and will really help out the channel. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like and comment down below. And...